Okay, welcome to the second part of my video, how to make a watermark to logo in Photoshop CS5 part 2. In this part I'm going to be showing you how to put your watermark to logo into Sony Vegas and make it last throughout the video. So this is your logo, well it's my logo, but your logo looks pretty much the same as this, um, without the white background. So what you're going to do is open up Sony Vegas. Now you're going to want to click import media and now you're going to want to import your video that you're going to want to use. So mine will be in here. And I'm going to use my recent video, how to make a hazard background with clouds and object and for text. Yeah, okay. So I'm just going to drag that down into there I'm going to scroll to the bottom where there's no channel I'm just going to right click into the video track so make sure the video track is where it says number one and make sure it's not number two so make sure it is number one and you're going to want to click that in part media once again and then find your watermarked logo. There it is. Trial watermark logo. So that's open. Just plunk it into there. And as you see, it's not the full size of the video. So what you're going to want to do is just drag this to. I don't know, drag this one. No, nothing. Just going to want to just drag it the full length of the video. It should tell you that it's there. Yeah. Okay. So as you see, it's right in the middle of the um, video, which you don't really want. And but it hasn't got the white outline, so that's pretty good. So on that channel where it says number one and your logo, you're going to want to click onto this little square, which is like pretty much like this crop. So it says event pan slash crop. So you're going to want to click that. You're going to want to zoom out with your middle wheel of your mouse to about there. And if you see in the pre preview, just to the right, if I move that, if I move this F, the logo moves. So if I make this bigger, it gets smaller. But you want your logo about up there, don't you? But if you move it out a bit, it disappears. So to fix that, you're going to want to right click and match output aspect. And then that stops the disappearing out of the frame. So you're just going to want to make it a bit bigger. So it looks about the same. And then just about right. And then just plunk it right into the corner. You could make it bigger if you wanted, I mean smaller even, by just dragging them boxes out. So there we go, that's in the corner of your um, video. What are pretty good to stop um, people copying your videos, even though you could have an intro at the beginning, but they could always cut that out, but they can't cut watermarks out unless like they chop the top of the video off, which isn't really good. So I'm just going to close it off, and that's it really. That's your video watermark done, and as you see, it is at the top of your video like that, and it will stay there for the rest of your video that it's running for, and then it will stop when the video stops. So thanks for watching, Jack and Norman Designs, how to make a watermark in Photoshop, CS5, and also how to put it in Sony Vegas. Um, Sony Vegas 10. <laughs> Man, isn't there? So, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, comment, and rate.